letting imperialism decide the NFL's greatest team. Let me explain. What I'll be doing is spinning this wheel to pick a team, and then spinning this arrow to see which way they need to attack. So let's say this wheel lands on the Saints, and the arrow points north. The Saints will travel north until they reach the Chiefs. These two will play four one-minute quarters to battle it out. The winning team doesn't just take the land, but also the best player on the losing team. I will be repeating this process until one team rules them all. Did I mention that the field is going to shrink down to eventually a one-inch field as teams get eliminated? Well, it is. Now pick your team and cross your fingers because one-inch Madden imperialism starts now. All right, here we go. We're spinning the wheel and we got the Cowgirls, all right? And the Cowboys will be attacking Northwest. Okay, it looks like the Cowboys will be invading Denver. Second and six. Denver already called a timeout. Another run play. Oh my God, Pollard! Pollard and fumbles! Wow! And Denver picks it up! 38 seconds. Can Denver pull this off? Russell drops back. He throws it. It's caught! Wow, Jerry Judy! Denver actually might pull this off, all because Tony Pollard fumbled. Russell. It's Spin again. Who's it gonna be? It's gonna be the Niners. The Super Bowl favorites will be attacking north. The Niners will be traveling north to take on Seattle. What will they do here? It's so loud. Purdy feels the pressure and he's sacked. Jake Moody. Here we go. The kick is up and it's good. Gino. He's gotta go deep here. Oh, he chooses to throw it. Are they gonna call a timeout? Are they open for the field goal, I guess? They're going for this. Five seconds. Chino going long here to the end zone. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's almost caught. There's a flag. Oh my God, it's P.I. They're gonna tie the game with a chip shot. Oh my God, we're going OT. I think Seattle just won the toss. They've elected to receive. Second down, Chino again. He gets through. Picks up Bosa, and we get to see the Cowboys play again. And they will be attacking West. It looks like the Cowboys will be attacking Arizona. 10 seconds left in the first half. Dak drops back. He's going to run it. No, he doesn't. He finds Ferguson for the tutty. This is it. Fourth and six. Kyler dropping back. All the time in the world, he scrambles. Oh, and it's incomplete, and the Cowboys will take the land and move on. The Cowboys get Buda Baker, and we will now see the Kansas City Chiefs. And they will be attacking south, which means Kansas City will be attacking the Cowboys. Dak Prescott, 56 seconds in the third. First and 10, if they're smart, they should drive. Dak drops back, feels the pressure, and he's sacked! Sack Prescott! Casey calls a timeout. Only two left for the rest of the game. Dak drops back, and it's caught by C.D. Lamb, and it's short of the first down, third and two. Another timeout from Kansas City. Third down, 48 seconds in the third. They run it with Pollard, and he gets the first down. And Kansas City calls their third and final timeout in the third quarter. All right, it looks like the Cowboys are going to run another play here. They do. Dak drops back, gets the first down. Brandon Cooks! The Cowboys are in victory formation. They'll kneel the ball, and that will do it. Dallas beats Kansas City. The Cowboys now with Patrick Mahomes, but first we will see the Cleveland Browns, and they will be attacking West, which means the Browns will be attacking Indy. This could be it. Lucas Oil Stadium's going crazy. Third and five, Flacco drops back to the end zone, and it's... Colts 
able to receive Miles Garrett, and we will now see the Bengals take the field. And the Bengals will be attacking West, which means the Bengals will now be attacking Indy. Here we go, fourth quarter, midfield, one minute. Browning dropping back, throwing it deep to Jamar Chase. win the toss and elect to receive. Can the Colts keep the drive alive? Minshew is sacked by Trey Hendrickson. Five seconds left for Jake Browning. I guess this is playoff OT. And it's gonna go to a second OT. Jake Browning drops back. It's thrown into the end zone. And goes to Cincinnati and we get to see the Seahawks and the Seahawks will be attacking East which means Seattle will travel all the way to Minnesota and take on the Vikings let's go two more plays to go 10 yards and a timeout you got Hawkinson and you got Justin Jefferson he drops back and he's sacked 11 seconds and a miracle he drops back, and he gets sacked again. Seattle takes all of the land. Getting closer and closer, Jefferson heads to Seattle, and we get to see the Raiders. And the Raiders will be attacking West, which means the Raiders will now be attacking Seattle. Oh, baby. Feeling the pressure, he throws it, he's got an open man, it's caught! And a touchdown! Gino drops back, too much time, it's caught by DK, and he stops the man! No huddle, second and inches. Finally, they call the timeout. Pete Carroll may have just made the biggest or second biggest mistake of his career. Gino dropping back, he has time, he throws it at. He could have simply ran it in, but he didn't. This might be ball game. Gino drops back, finds the open man, and he steps out. They got like two plays here. Gino drops back, finds the open man, and it's caught. Touchdown! They're going for two. Oh my God, this is game. Gino drops back, and it's caught again. Justin Jefferson will win it. Seattle gets Max Crosby. And we now get to watch the Commanders. They will be attacking West. You can hardly see them, but they will be traveling Southwest and facing the Carolina Panthers. Fourth and two, fourth quarter, 14 seconds remain. Bryce Young drops back, throws it, and it's incomplete, and that will do it. The Commanders will take the Panthers' land. Derek Brown is heading to Washington, and we get to see Seattle. They will be attacking South, which means Seattle will be attacking Dallas for all of this land. Let's go. Third and goal here. Just one yard. Mahomes finds C.D. Lamb, and the Cowboys are the first on the board. One more first down, and it's over. Mahomes drops back, and it's thrown to C.D. Lamb, and that should put the nail in the coffin. And this will do it. The Cowboys take all of Seattle's land. Justin Jefferson will join the Cowboys, and we get to see the Giants, and they will be attacking East, the Southeast, which means the Giants will be taking on the New York Jets. Here we go, the field goal. Greg the leg to send it to OT. Here we go, the kick is up, and it's good! The Jets win the toss and elect to receive one eternity later. In the fifth overtime, Greg Zerline for the field goal and the win. And it's good. The Jets beat the Giants.
The Jets get Dexter Lawrence, and we get to see the Eagles now. And the Eagles will be attacking South, which means the Eagles will be invading Baltimore. Let's do it. 54 yards for Jake Elliott for the win. It's up. get Roquan Smith and we get to see the Packers now they will be attacking East which means the Packers will travel over water and face the Lions Jared Goff third and one 26 seconds three timeouts he throws it and it's caught in field goal range they call a timeout with 11 seconds here we go the snap the kick it is good! The Lions take the lead! Six to three with eight seconds left. Can he do anything? He drops back, launches it, and it's incomplete in that game. The Lions will take the Packers land. The Lions get Jair Alexander, cornerback, and we see the Bears. And Chicago will be attacking north which means the bears will now be invading the lions 33 seconds now second and inches the lions hand it off he gets it and he lays down are they not going to kick this field goal they hand it off with five seconds four seconds they call the timeout to win the game the lions the kick is up and it's good the get even better and pick up Jalen Johnson and we get to finally see the Patriots. They will be attacking Northwest, which means the Patriots will be attacking the New York Jets. Will the Patriots do something here? It's thrown perfectly and caught and he's in! New York's getting loud almost at midfield, the 46 yard line. One timeout remaining. He drops back, he goes deep here. It's caught by Garrett Wilson, and they call a timeout. Zach Wilson, no timeouts. So much time, finds the open receiver, and he steps out. We'll probably get maybe one or two plays. Zach Wilson drops back, going for the end zone, and it's incomplete. The Patriots are two seconds away from claiming New York's land. Zach Wilson, the last ball, it's deep. And there's a flag! It's deep behind! Oh my god, the Patriots! The Jets! Will win the game! Oh my god, that's it! The Jets will take their best player and all of their land with it! The Jets receive Trent Brown from the Patriots, and we get to see the Jets again! And the Jets will be attacking Northwest, which means the Jets will take on Buffalo. We're in overtime, and the Jets elect to receive 16 teams after this. 39 seconds left. Wilson drops back, finds Garrett Wilson. Oh my God! The Jets are on the 30. A TD will win the game. Zach Wilson, Garrett Wilson holds on. To it, second and goal. Zach Wilson drops back, end zone, and that's game. The Jets will move on and take Buffalo's land. The Jets got Stefan Diggs, and we get to see the Dolphins, and they will be attacking Northwest, which means our first 10 yard game will be the Dolphins attacking the Buccaneers. Every game from here on out is gonna be played on the commander's field because it's the only field that can show off the mod, okay? It's a tie game at 18. OT, Mayfield drops back. Oh, almost gets sacked. Does he get out of the end zone? He does, and he's dropped. There's a flag, face mask. That's not good. Oh my God, on the seven yard line now. Drops back. Oh, he gets brought down. Mayfield finds the end zone. He's incomplete. He's out of bounds. Can Tua take half of Florida and their best player, Raheem, powering through. One TD ends this game right now. Tua drops back. Looking at the end zone. The Dolphins 
improve with a free safety and we get to see the Jets. And the Jets will be attacking south, which means the Jets will be attacking Philadelphia. Let's do it. Philly gets the ball. They're up three. Jalen Hurts finds Swift, and he gets brought down for a safety. Third quarter, there's only been four seconds in the third. Zach Wilson, scrambling, finds the open receiver. We see a handoff. We will, and he gets in. If they get this, it'll be a seven-point game. Zach Wilson, not sure where to go, and gets sacked. My man was staring at a MILF in the 300 section. The fourth quarter, the Eagles down by five. It's do or die. Jalen gets sacked for the safety. Zach Wilson with the ball now, hands it off to Hall, and he gets 10. Philly has two timeouts. They need to stop them here. They have to. Brees Hall drops a man, gets the first down. And that will be it! The Jets beat the Eagles! The Eagles are gone and the Jets get A.J. Brown and we finally see the Titans. They will be attacking Southeast or West, Southwest. That means the Titans will be traveling Southwest and facing off against another team we haven't seen yet, the Saints. 12 seconds. One timeout, drops back. He's going for it. Gets the first down, the ball, their last timeout here with six seconds. Only a couple plays, maybe two, maybe two. Finds the end zone, and it's almost picked off. Who's moving on? Who's taking the land of the best player? Tennessee, drop it back, end zone. Hail Mary, oh, and it's broken up at New Orleans. is now a New Orleans Saint and we will finally see the Texans and Houston will be attacking West which means Houston will be attacking Dallas Mahomes drops back look at end zone again and they get it Jake Ferguson wide open Mahomes will he go end zone here he doesn't Oh, almost, finally, the second half. You have no idea, man. Please hand it off. Please, he doesn't. He throws it deep. It's caught by CeeDee Lamb. And he gets in for six. Fourth and 10, do we see the glitch here? Do we see it? We do. This is gonna be <laughs> a safety for Dallas. Dallas up by a lot and still throwing the ball. I, I don't get it. Will they get the first down here? They will, and some. Touchdown, Cowboys. Finally, the Cowboys in victory formation. The Cowboys will move on. The Cowboys get Tunsil, and we get to see the Jaguars. And they will be attacking Northwest, which means the Jags will be going to ATL and attacking the Falcons. It's 110 to 96. It's first and negative five. And he nails the ball for a safety. The Falcons have a minute to score 12. Drops back, finds the open man, and he's in! Drake London! And that will do it. The Jags beat Atlanta. The Jags get their free safety, Jesse Bates, and we get to see the Jets. And they are attacking Southwest, which means the Jets will be taking on the Steelers. Let's go. The Jets are down by 36 to the Steelers. And I think the Steelers are gonna kneel it here, giving the Jets 62. That's gonna be it for the Jets. They're gonna try to get the this, this playoff, it doesn't matter. They don't call a timeout. They finally do it with one second left, and the Steelers, oh, they score. It doesn't matter. The Steelers win 96 to 70. A.J. Brown joins the Steelers, and we now see the Saints, and the Saints will be attacking Southwest, which means the Saints will be attacking the Cowboys. Here we go. 16-point game. Derek Carr, third quarter. So much 
much land for grabs. The play action of Camaro goes deep and it's picked up! And they nailed the ball! Mahomes drops back. He's going deep. Finds the open man and brought down. Mahomes, the handoff to Pollard, and he's in! Minute left, Derek Carr has all day. Finds the open receiver, hikes the ball, drops back. Can he get a touchdown? He will! What a Goliath. They're probably gonna run the ball here. They will to Pollard, and he gets in! Oh no, he's short, third and goal. They're gonna kneel it, and that should be game, and it will be. The Cowboys beat the Saints in a nail-biter. Derrick Henry heads to the Cowboys, and we're one game away from a five-yard field, the Dolphins. They will be attacking West. So that means the Dolphins will be traveling West against Dallas. It's 70 to 70. Here we go. Tua needs to score here. Has to score here. He drops back. Look at end zone. He has a Jalen Waddle. 33 seconds remaining. He was wide open. Cowboys taking over here. Mahomes. Play action, goes long here. Jake Ferguson again. Mahomes drops back, look at end zone. Oh my God, it's incomplete. Can the Miami defense hang on? Second and goal, Mahomes, look at end zone. And it's gone by Jake Ferguson. It could come down to this two point conversion. Mahomes, it's incomplete. He went for Jake Ferguson and didn't get it. And that will do it. Jefferson joins the Dolphins. The Cowboys threw like we knew they would. The Lions will be our first team on a five-yard field. They will be attacking Northeast, which means the Lions will be attacking Cincinnati. Five yards, let's go. It's 162 to 142. 34 seconds down by 20. They got to make moves here. What's going on? Browning backing up, and it's caught for six. Fourth quarter, if Jared Goff scores here, the Lions, it's over. And there it is. The Lions will beat the Bengals. Garrett joins Detroit and we see the Dolphins. Oh my God. They will be attacking West, which means the Dolphins will finally invade LA. We have made it to the fourth quarter. Stafford, play action, looking end zone, obviously incomplete. There's a flag, is it holding? Pass interference, 56 seconds, Stafford. Drops back, looking end zone, fights Kyron! Miami, probably gonna run the ball here. Wouldn't be surprised, they do. And Raheem is brought down a second timeout by the Rams. If Miami scores here, it's most likely over. Most likely. They hand it off to Raheem, and he's brought down! 17 seconds, Stafford drops back. Going for the end zone, it's out of bounds. With three seconds left, Matthew Stafford one second, time expires. It's caught by Cooper Cup. It does not matter though. Miami will move on. Aaron Donald joins the Dolphins and we see the Jags now. And they will be attacking Northeast, which means the Jaguars will be facing off against the Washington Commanders. Let's go. Last quarter for Sam Howell, drops back. He's gonna run it, he stops, gets the touchdown. That was good, they need a turnover now, big time. We're getting an onside kick here. It's up, and he's cracked for a safety. And just like that, Washington gets the ball back. 50 seconds, Sam Howell, all the time, starts to run, and he takes it in and gets stopped at the one. Fourth and goal, one yard, that's it. That's it, Sam Howell dropping back, decides to run it in, he fumbles, and the Jags take possession. But they're gonna need it, it's gonna be a safety. Oh my God! <laughs> We're not gonna see any field goals anymore. Sam Howell going end zone, and he gets it! Samuel for six! Trevor Lawrence down 
to. Snaps the ball, play action, and it's a touchdown! Just like that to Calvin Ridley! 27 seconds. He snaps the ball, looking end zone, and he's wide open again. What a back and forth this has been. 24 seconds. Here we go, finds the end zone, it's almost picked off! 15 seconds, third and goal. Two stops for Washington. T-Law runs it in! This might be the last play right here. Sam Howell drops back. Three seconds, two. Oh my God, it's almost picked and they have one second. One second, Sam Howell. Just needs six. And it's picked up! And Jacksonville hangs on! Scary Terry goes to Jacksonville and we see the Dolphins. They will attack south, which means if we go to the left here, we will finally see the Chargers. 238 to 198. Miami dominating San Diego, or they're the LA Chargers now, right? I don't know. Hikes the ball, goes to the end zone, and he's in for a touchdown! 33 seconds, hands the ball off to Raheem Mostert, and he's in! This game is over! The Dolphins take the Chargers land, finally! Four teams remain. Derwin James is now on the Dolphins. We now see the Lions, and they will be attacking south, which means the first game on the one-yard field will be the Lions versus the Dolphins. A minute left! We're tied at 822! What the hell? What's going on? Miami with one timeout. <laughs> Fourth and goal. To him, drops back, looking at zone. It's got it. Justin Jefferson to get the Dolphins six. That's crazy. Goff, gonna just, he could just run it in. Throws it. What? Third and goal. Goff backs up. End zone. It's covered. Touchdown. Tua drops back, throws it. And it's a safety. The Lions might kneel the ball here. <laughs> And that's gonna give Miami two and the ball back. 26 seconds, second and goal. Tua drops back, looks end zone. He's gonna run it in. No, he throws it anyway. And it's caught by Tyreek Hill. And the Dolphins take the lead. 10 seconds left. This is absolutely insane. He drops back. And it's almost picked off. Oh my God. Second and goal. Seven seconds. That's so much time with this field. Tua drops back, looks end zone. And it's coming off the rebound. We gotta see this again. The throw, the tip, and the catch. My goodness, what a play. They need this to tie. This is big. Tua looking again for the tight end, and he catches it, and it's in. I'm afraid the Lions are gonna need the ball here. I don't think so. It's a tie game. Yeah, they're not. Four seconds. That's, that's enough time for two drives, honestly, if they score on this first one. Jared Goff for the end zone. It's almost picked off. Oh, my God. We might go to OT. Jared Goff has one second. Will we go to overtime at 900? Jared Goff drops back. End zone. And he catches it. That is game. The Lions win it. The Lions get Tyreek Hill, and we will see the Steelers. And they will be attacking south, which means the Steelers will be attacking the Jaguars and the Lions will move on to the finals. Let's go. It's 988 to 990 with 17 seconds left. It's first and negative 14. Pickett end zone, touchdown. A booth review. Will it be upheld? I guess the TD didn't count. It was upheld. I don't know. I guess he was out. Pickett end zone. It's touchdown! Two-point conversion is massive right now. Huge. He drops back. He's gonna run for it, and he gets it! Four seconds, second and goal. Trevor Lawrence. He drops back, looks end zone, and it's bad!
are set for the one inch field. It's the Lures versus the Lions. We're gonna spin the wheel and see who is attacking who. It's going to be the Steelers attacking the Lions. The winner of this wins it all. Let's do it. Here we go. First quarter, go. The Lions already pulling away, but the Lures come right back. I don't know how high the score is gonna get. First quarter, it's almost done. Three seconds, two seconds, and the Steelers are up by 24. Oh my goodness. This is just insane madness. The Steelers hit the 400 mark. The Lions following right behind them. Very close game. First half is over, and the Steelers are up by a ton. The Lions can't do anything. The Steelers get 700. They're up by like 40 points. Do the Lions have a chance? They're down by 40. Why are the Lions coming back? How are the Lions coming back right now? I don't even know what to say. It's a 30 point game with nine seconds. This is really scary though, because you don't know what can happen with this much time. Pickett going for the two point conversion, he gets it. This could be the longest nine seconds ever. Jared Goff, first and goal, drops back. Looking for the end zone, out of bounds. And it's a safety. <laughs> I thought they were gonna kneel it here. They run it, and Najee Harris runs it in, and it's a 40-point game. First and goal for Jared Goff. He drops back, looks end zone, and it's picked, and he kneels in. Mika Fitzpatrick ends the game. The Steelers take all the land and reign supreme. I can't believe it. Well, there you have it, the Steelers win the first ever one yard one inch imperialism if you enjoyed hit the like button down below subscribe if you're new let me know if you want to see more of this and i'll see you next time yeah,